Hey, Kamusta? It's a boy Jeff here back again with another review and today we're gonna review, you you guessed it, another Tomica event model. That's right, and I can't seem to find the opening uh, part right here. Yeah, check this out. Today we're gonna review the Lamborghini Countach Tomica event model. So yo, check this out. So this one is in white, um, obviously, and 23. The front light tempos uh, or the silver lights right there, the Lamborghini emblem, yada yada yada, standard on some cars with the front wheel light tempos and the articulation. Look at that, the rear, they're, they're detailed in black right here. The what's this? This is like a rear intake for the engine, I don't know, but it's detailed in matte black uh, windows. There are no opening doors, but there's some more details. Number 23 right there, because yeah, you guess it, it's number 23 in the Tomica event model line, so it makes sense. And Tomica event model in this very unique font. It's written on the side skirt of the Kuntash. And I've always really hated this Tomica event model written on all of the TEM cars. But this one is not that bad because it runs nicely along the side skirt. So I'll close one eye on that. This does have an opening feature. No opening doors, no opening hood, but an opening rear hatch to see the engine right there detailed in grey. I think it's a, oh, it's a plastic. So check that out. I mean, this, it's not really detailed, but it's cool. You gotta love opening features and suspension on this car as well wait all right that's that's not bad the suspension is pretty springy and it would be cool to see the lp500 version with a spoiler but i guess this stock version will do as well it's actually not that bad it, it has a very clean look so from a scale of 1 to 10 i love the lamborghini Countach, man it's a lambo fanboy this looks cool but i think it's just a bit too plain once again i would have preferred an lp500 release of this version but i can't complain because it really it, it really depends so i think i'll give this a pretty nice 9.5 out of 10 not bad not bad i think the rear just looks a kind of bit weird if they give it the signal lights you know the orange lights i'll give it a 10 out of 10 but maybe a 9.5 out of 10